Well, Merry Christmas. My name is David and I'm the pastor of Walden Community Church here in Montgomery, Texas. And through the month of December, we are looking at the 12 days of Christmas as our December devotional. And I think most of us know this as a fun song, right? We certainly all enjoy singing this with a large group and we all enjoy getting to the part where we get to sing five golden rings. But did you ever wonder why there's so many verses about birds, <laughs> right? There's a lot of birds. And you might be thinking, if these are all gifts for someone you love, why would you give that person so many birds? Well, originally the 12 days of Christmas are feast days that follow from Christmas all the way to Epiphany, the day the church recognizes the wise men visiting the baby Jesus. Well, if these are all feast days, then each day would either be food or uh, guests or entertainment at a party. And so as the days increase, the party gets larger and larger and larger, and therefore there are more people to feed. And so these birds are not presents, they are dinner. <laughs> Today we're at day 10, and that takes us to 10 lords a-leaping. In every one of these devotionals, we've been asking ourselves, is there a verse in this that also lines up with the Christian faith? And I think 10 lords a-leaping is the easiest one out of all of them to understand. The Lord in England is somebody who is a judge or somebody who is in charge of the law. So 10 Lords would be the 10 commandments. The 10 commandments are, you shall have no other gods before me. You shall not make idols. You shall not take the name of the Lord your God in vain. Remember the Sabbath and keep it holy. Honor your father and mother. You shall not murder. You shall not commit adultery. You shall not steal. You shall not bear false witness against your neighbor, and you shall not covet. You know, God gave the Ten Commandments to Moses as a foundation of law for the nation of Israel. And when Jesus began his ministry, over a thousand years later, he was once asked what the greatest commandment out of all ten was. And without hesitation, Jesus said, Love the Lord your God with all your heart and soul and mind and strength. And then he added this, and the second is this, to love your neighbor as yourself. There is no commandment greater than these. That means Jesus took those 10 rules of do's and do nots, and he narrowed them down to two very simple rules to live by, to love God and to love others. Merry Christmas.